Now, the Xfinity Sports Zone. What's up, sports fans? Sarah Hodges with you. The college baseball season is heating up, and there aren't many teams hotter than Sacramento State right now. With just one loss on the season, they're currently ranked as the 23rd best Division I baseball pro program in the country. Only team ahead of them in the standings from California, Stanford. Always a number obvious when you do that, but, you know, just regular, regular stuff for the Hornets. <laughs> For the first time in school history, the Hornets have earned a spot in four different national top 25 rankings. It's pretty exciting. It's pretty cool to look at, but you know, we try not to focus on that. We try to just focus on one game at a time, and uh, obviously, we're not satisfied with where we are right now. We want to be better. So, behind their success, a legendary skipper who's helped Sac State to 30 or more wins in each of their last nine seasons. Good players, good players, that's the secret, and uh, good assistant coaches. We've been really uh, blessed to have a really good group of guys for, yeah, going on 10 years now. Our coaching staff does a really good job getting us prepared and getting us ready to play, you know, and I think that's a, that's a huge deal for us, and, you know, it gets us ready to go, gets us ready to win. They're the only Division One program in the country with such a streak. We just try to focus on ourselves. I know that might sound cliche, but at the end of the day, we just have to go out and play good baseball. This year, they're looking to keep it alive, already collecting eight dubs on this young season. Uh, I think this group just trying to fight every fight that they have, um, trying to every game is a new opportunity. We're going to fight every fight. We're not, not going to win them all, but we're going to fight them all. All right, and they did some fighting today against Houston Baptist. Sac State continuing their success, downing the Huskies 21 to 4. Yes, you're seeing that right. 21 runs. Hopefully, they're going to save some for tomorrow because, guys, they got a double header. And you know, with those double headers, and it's a four game series, it is not going to be easy.